Publix. You like my new haircut? I got my haircut. So I'm in Publix. And I'm here buying some groceries, waiting for my mom. Guys, I look bigger. My, my body feels like, not bigger, I actually look smaller. My head looks smaller. And the girl I was talking to, she was really cool. I didn't get her name, but she's a singer, so it's really cool. Um, I was trying to make sure to, for her to subscribe and like my YouTube channel. But yeah, guys, so I'm in Publix and I'm waiting. I'm here to get a bunch of vegetables and healthy stuff and get some string cheese and get some, get some peas and get some corn and some mixed vegetables. So I will be back. Hold on. Try this apple and peaches. Okay, and then they have get three fruit cups for seven dollars. So there, we're gonna do peaches. We're gonna do mixed vegetables. Mix. We're gonna do 100% real juice. We're gonna do mix. Okay, that's two. And I'm gonna do peaches. I'm gonna do peaches. Excuse me. Okay, and then we're going to, this is the candy section, I can't have that. So now we're going to look for Mrs. Dash, a big container of Mrs. Dash, guys. I act like you guys are here with me, I wish you guys were. I, oops, sorry. Nope, nope. not that section. Hold on, babies, no. This is Dash, he's right there. So now we're gonna go get the ground turkey. Eat with some love. See the meat straight ahead, guys? Now we're looking for turkey. Turkey. I see turkey. I see turkey. Mm. Oh, no, I don't see turkey actually. Mm. Mm. Actually, I see this type of turkey. I see this type of turkey. Okay. But I don't see ground turkey. What am I going to eat turkey? Hi. Okay, so now, the turkey, turkey, 
I want to go get eggs. I have to go get eggs. I have to stop every time, like, when my mom comes around because she doesn't want to be on my camera, so it's fine. It's okay. One day, maybe. I don't know when. I really don't know if she'll ever be on my videos. Maybe it just depends on her. Okay, I'm looking for... Oh, I wanted to try the chicken sausage, but I don't know. It's so funny that I was just here not that long ago, I was jumping, buying all this junk. And now I'm looking like 70 pounds down and like a different person. It feels so much better. And like literally guys, like it's not even funny. Like the 31st is my stress test. And like after that, I'm like done. Okay, here are the eggs. Can I mention again? I'll meet you at the car. We can make our own pizza. Okay guys, now I'm going to get lettuce and tomatoes too. Okay, now I'm going to get lettuce and tomato guys. And I'm passing all my faves, all my favorites. Favorites. I'm gonna go get lettuce and tomato guys. I said it like three times already. And then I'm gonna check out. I have so much hair on me now.
I notice when other fat people look at me, they're like still judging, but it's like, honey, you still big too, and no one judges you. I hate that. But they do it, so I'll be back, guys. Hey guys, I'm back. I made it home. I went grocery shopping. Got all my favorites, got my haircut. I don't know how I look. Let me know in the comments if you guys like the new haircut. Uh, I feel like, I feel like I'm so dark. Hold on, let me turn the light on. I'm bald, I'm bald. Okay, so today for lunch, guys, we're having ground turkey and beans. Ground, per ground turkey and beans. Mmm. They're hot. Okay, so, I'm having fat-free yogurt, strawberry and banana, from Walmart, I mean from Publix. I went to Publix. I mean, I went to. I went to Glade. <clears throat> Grade Clips or something. To get my hair cut. And then I went to Publix. I just spent $82. Why is there not in here? I spent $82 on groceries. Let me put this in so you guys can hear me better. $82 on groceries. Um, next week because phase two starts again. I mean, phase one is next week. Again, I do phase... I do phase one for two weeks, and then I do phase two for one week. And then I have my last stress, I have my stress test on the 30th, and I have my last doctor visit, as I needed to see her for three months. So I saw her June, July, and August will be the last, will be the last visit. So I'm approved there. My, so, I have to do a stress test on the 30th. Um, literally, that's my last test. And then, this Thursday, I have to do blood work that they need me to do. So, all of this is done. Road steps. Road to bariatric surgery. So I'm basically done. Um, I'm a lot closer than when I was when I first went to celebration. In 2016, when I wanted to do the surgery, and I'm sorry, I'm chewing. There's a lot of chewing in this. I'm so proud of myself because then I wasn't losing any weight because she, the nutritionist that we saw, she wanted me up every two seconds walking. And I know that's good, yes. But in 2016, my head wasn't in it. I wasn't ready for it. I wasn't focusing, focusing on it. And I was seeing her like all the time. And she was like weighing me in. And I wasn't like losing any weight. And um, she was like preaching at me. And I don't like when people preach at me because if they don't understand what I've been through, and then they want to have the audacity to come and preach at you, like, listen, if you don't lose this weight, you're going to die, blah, 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 blah. And I'm like, that's true. She was right. 
But I wasn't ready. I want to. I want to try this first, guys, on camera. Oh my god! It just exploded on me. What the heck? Oh. You gotta look the lid. I'm sorry, guys. You can tell that this has no sugar in it, cause it tastes like. Look at it. Look at that. You can tell. I was wrong. It's pretty good. This is the good bacteria that's gonna help my digestive system. You guys want to bite? Hell. Um. um Strawberry and banana. So, I wasn't focusing on doing the diet. But, like, now that I'm focusing on doing it, now that I'm focused on doing it, I have lost 71 pounds, guys. I never thought I would lose 71 pounds, like, ever. I thought that I was just not going to lose anything and then I was just going to be like so depressed that I wasn't going to lose the weight. And when I'm telling you guys, oh, I didn't say this is my second video today. I'm, I don't know why I didn't say that. I think I said it when I first walked into Publix. Um, oh, and I'm almost there, but I don't have to use a cart and I can walk. Okay, I'm almost there. Um, I need to buy tighter clothes because my clothes are starting to get too big on me. So they're actually making me look bigger than what I am. But um, I'm really proud of myself. Like I've done it, you know. Um, I know like I want people around me that... Oh, what I was saying, I'm sorry. When I was in Publix today, it was so hard because like I went down the, I went down, I stayed away from all the chips and the junk, junk aisles, but you know, like on the end of the aisle, there's like those shelves with like all the stuff, like half off, blah, 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 blah. They had all my stuff that I like, my chips, they had my cookies, they had my Pringles, they had my soda. And for the first time I can say, in 30 years, because I've been on this earth for 30 years, I've been able to fight my addiction for the first time in my life. And it was so rewarding. Because look, I'm eating uh, non-fat, non-fat free yogurt with beans and corn and ground turkey and a crystal light when instead I probably would have been having a pizza. <laughs> And a bag of chips that I would have been eating. Well, um, you guys are you guys are what make me keep going. Literally, you guys are keeping me accountable for this diet because without you guys, I don't know if I could have done it this time. Like, I should have started social media so long ago, and I've said that before. Um, because that probably would have helped me back then if I would have started social media before. Especially like when Logan Paul was coming up, Jake Paul and 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 Cameron Dallas and all of them, because I feel like I would be friends with a lot of people and I feel like I could have done it. But I didn't I didn't think that I was good looking, so I was like, I'm not gonna put myself on camera, I'm butt ugly. But I don't care anymore. Like, love me or hate me. Like literally that's my I finish it. Literally, that's like my slogan right now. It's like, love me or hate me. If you're going to hate me, then stay off my channel. If you're going to hate me, then stay, you know, don't be my friend. But what I don't want to happen is when I get big, and I know I will get big. I have, I have, I have faith in myself. It might take me four or five years, but when I get big, I know it's coming. Um, oh my God. Sorry, microphone people were listening. Okay. Um. People are going to try to come out of the woodworks. Like, oh, I'm your so-and-so. Blah, 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 blah. 
Um, if I truly know you, I have no problem helping you. If you truly have a need and you need help, I have no problem helping you. That's not, I'm not an evil person, but if you're there just to use me and hurt me, then we have a problem. But if you're there because if you're there because you like want to be a part of whatever and you want to be with me, that's fine. Hmm. I don't know this was in this. <laughs> Um, I forgot to get my, I forgot to stop at the P.O. Box and ask them, what are the requirements to get a P.O. Box? I'll probably try to do that maybe Thursday and ask the question, or maybe I'll call the number and ask the question, but... Yeah. This is really good, guys. You guys would like this. Mm. But. I'm telling you guys. If you guys are a fan of mine. And you live around where I live. Don't be scared to come up and say hi. I will take a picture with you. I will talk to you. I have no problem with that. Um, yeah, I have no problem with that. That to me is like, so it's so dope. I've talked to a lot of my friends on Instagram live and like, I have no problem with that. Um, I really wish my PO box would have worked because I would be doing a lot of unboxing of stuff if you guys wanted to send me stuff, but it didn't work, so it's fine. But maybe one day <laughs> I can get one, but it'll be all right. It'll be all right. Mm. You know, I can't wait until the Dalton Twins post today because last week's video was hilarious. Got their nose fixed and all that anesthesia they were on. <laughs> they were hilarious. I don't even remember mine being that bad, and I've been on it. Mm -hmm. Oh, an announcement, guys. <coughs> Excuse me announcement I don't know if I can record the two days the morning of surgery probably but the day after surgery I don't know if I'll be with it to record so I'll try guys if I can okay uh, thank you guys so much for watching enjoy my trip today to Publix and I'll see you guys tomorrow peace make sure to like and subscribe turn on my notifications